Welcome to the CTTP training videos. ASTO T308 Determining the Asphalt Binder Content of Asphalt Mixtures by the Ignition Method This video demonstrates the determination of the asphalt binder content of a plant-produced asphalt mixture using an NCAT convection ignition oven. Turn on the ignition oven and set the chamber temperature to the temperature used to determine the binder content correction factor, which is either 482 or 538 degrees Celsius. See Annex A and ASHTO T308 for more information. Allow approximately 3 hours for the ignition oven to reach the chamber set point. Obtain a representative portion of the asphalt mixture and reduce it to the required sample size. Oven dry the sample at mixing temperature prior to testing, or collect a separate representative sample and determine the moisture content according to ASHTO T329. If the sample is not warm enough to separate, warm the sample at 230 plus or minus 9 degrees Fahrenheit until it is workable. Do not heat the sample for an extended period of time. Zero an external scale and place the basket assembly on the scale platform. Record the mass of the empty basket assembly, then remove it from the scale. Remove the top basket and set it aside. Place approximately half of the sample in the bottom basket. Evenly distribute the sample in the basket and move the mix away from the basket edges to prevent material loss during testing. Replace the top basket and remove the lid. Place the remaining half of the sample in the top basket. Evenly distribute the sample and move the mix away from the basket edges. Complete the basket assembly by securing the lid and assembly guard. Zero the scale and place the basket assembly on the scale platform. Record the total mass of the basket assembly and sample. Determine the initial mass of the sample by subtracting the mass of the empty basket assembly from the total mass of basket assembly and sample. Round the initial mass of the sample to the nearest 1 gram. Input the binder calibration factor by pressing the Calib Factor button and then quickly entering the value and pressing Enter. The decimal is automatic, so a value of 0 0.18 would be entered as 0, 018. Verify the entry by pressing the Calib Factor button again. Input the initial mass of the sample by pressing the Weight button, entering the initial mass, and pressing Enter. Verify the initial mass by pressing the Weight button again. Zero the ignition oven's internal scale by pressing the Zero button. Verify that the scale reads 0, 0.0. To protect yourself from the extreme heat, wear appropriate personal protective equipment. Open the ignition oven door. Stand behind the door as it is open to prevent possible burns. Using the loading fork, load the basket assembly into the oven, placing it gently on the ceramic scale platform. Take care not to drag the basket across the ceramic plate as this could damage the internal scale. Position the basket so that it is not in contact with the oven walls and will not touch the insulation on the front door when closed. Close and latch the door. Verify that the total mass of the basket assembly and sample shown on the oven display is within 5 grams of the total mass recorded from the external scale. If not, reposition the basket assembly to eliminate rubbing or check the scale calibration. Once the total mass is verified, start the ignition oven burn sequence by pressing the start button. The scale will zero and the asphalt coatings will begin burning off the aggregate. The mass lost may be monitored on the oven display. When the ignition oven detects no additional loss over a 3 minute time period, the burn is complete. Stop the burn sequence and collect the data ticket. Record the calibrated asphalt content from the ticket to the nearest 0.01%. Remove the basket assembly from the ignition furnace with the loading fork. Place the basket assembly on a heat-resistant surface capable of withstanding 1,202 degrees Fahrenheit. Cover with the protective shield and allow the basket and aggregate to cool to room temperature. If the sample was not dried to constant mass prior to burning, subtract the moisture content from the calibrated asphalt content shown on the ticket. Report the binder content to the nearest 0.1%.
If the remaining aggregate is to be used for a gradation analysis, carefully empty the basket into a container. Perform the gradation analysis according to AASHTO T30. Please visit our website at cttp.org for other training videos and modules.